Hey everyone, I must have had butterfingers there. I dropped the phone while I was recording here. We got to the end, x of 1 is negative 2, y sub 1 is 14. Your final answer here, g, is located at negative 2, 14. Box that. That was 5a. Alright. We'll look at 5b here. We have p at negative 1, 3, g at 5, 6 and e at x of 1, y sub 1. Remember that p is your midpoint, so p at negative 1, 3 is equal to p at x of 1 plus 5 over 2, y sub 1 plus 6 over 2. All right, we're going to set this equal to negative 1. So you have x of 1 plus 5 over negative 1 equals negative 1. Oops, that's supposed to be a 2 there. Okay, x of 1 plus 5 over 2 equals negative 1. And then you have y of 1 plus 6 over 2 equals 3. Alright, so you're going to solve for x of 1 and y of 1. We'll multiply both sides by 2 here x of 1 plus 5 equals negative 2, subtract 5 from both sides, x of 1 equals negative 7, multiply both sides here by 2, y of 1 plus 6 equals 6, subtract 6 from both sides, y of 1 equals 0. Alright, so that means that our point E is located at negative seven comma zero.